here today with Fabi and Mary of Illumishade. Uh, again, this is Ethereal Metal. Thank you guys so much for taking the time to chat today. Beautiful day in New York City. How are you guys doing today? Well, first of all, thank you so much for having us. Of course. Yes, it's incredible here. It's my first time in New York ever. So yeah, it's pretty crazy to be here. Awesome, well, welcome. I know it's your first time, so welcome. That's amazing. Um, so I know I had mentioned just before we started uh, that you were here last year with Jonas and yes. with um, Yannick, Yannick with yes. um, Elevati, but this is the first time for Illumishade. So congratulations. Thank um, you I so know much. You guys just released your new album with Napalm which was amazing back in February. How does it feel to finally get out here in the States with Illumishade? Actually, it feels quite surreal, I have yeah. to say, right? Completely unreal. Yeah. Yesterday on stage, suddenly I was super emotional and tears coming <laughs> because, yeah, it's the first time we're here in America and yeah, just That's incredible great. after this journey. Album um, obviously has a Luma shade to it, but it's a lot more cinematic, a lot more cinematic, a lot more epic than mm -hmm. you know the 2020 self release. Mm -hmm. um, I wanted to just talk about that a little bit. Was that like a plan right from the get go? Did it kind of just evolve into that? Ah, we didn't really have a plan, I would say. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I mean, we released the first album during the Corona times. Sure. So yeah. I think everybody started rethinking their lives and thinking, what do we want and what do we not want to do in the future anymore? Exactly. <laughs> so we kind yeah. of took our time to just, you know, take it easy for a while, and then um, at some point we just wanted to make some music again without having a full-length album in mind so we just pretty much yeah. wrote a song because we felt like uh, mm -hmm. some of them made it actually to the um, final album yeah. once we started negotiating yeah. with napalm we kind of knew okay we we are going for it and we all really wanted it i think this break was quite mm -hmm. needed mm -hmm. yeah and yeah. uh yeah and i think we we didn't think too much about it. It's not like we had something specific in plan. We we want we wanted to to be sounding like that or yeah. We just mm, yeah yeah. It kind of evol evolved organically. So most of us are very spontaneous and you know from the gut. So yeah, yeah that's how yeah. these songs came together. <laughs> One thing about the orchestrations, they're really massive, really cinematic. Um, I think you had a part in that, right, Mary? Yeah, yeah so I'm yeah. a film composer, so that That's kind amazing. of bleeds yeah. into Illumishade a little For bit. For sure, yeah. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it's yeah. a lot of fun to like just experiment and go big. Cool. So uh, that's very cool. And is that something you've always wanted to do, film score and all that kind of stuff? It just, c it happened. Yeah. Because, uh, yeah, I first did a bit of orchestration for Elevati, actually. Yeah. And it came out of the blue because we knew each other from university and then the Great. project Illumishade happened. So I love it so much, but it was never a plan, but it's amazing. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's yeah. terrific. And then, so Fabi, for you, um, being the vocalist of the band and everything like that, how does it feel to kind of get your emotions, uh, especially with this new album, has a lot of emotions to it. How does it feel to finally get it out there to the fans? Yeah, it's definitely more grounded, I would say, this these lyrics than compared to the other one. Uh, first yeah. one were more about this fantasy world that we created. These now are more about the real life, let's say, yeah. the ups and downs sure. we all go through. So, uh, yeah. yeah, absolutely love to, to sing it. Great. Yeah. And I think the instrumentals really mesh well together, you know, kind of have like an opening in the intro. Um, you have that little interlude in the middle. And then I don't want to pronounce it incorrectly, but the song at the end, the closing song, I don't want to pronounce it incorrectly. Uh -huh. How do you say it again? Verliebt. 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 Okay. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful song. Absolutely beautiful song. I wanted to get a little bit more from the um, behind the scenes of that song, kind of. Oh, yeah. So mm, it was a piano demo. I don't know. It was 
created in like 2017 and okay. I just forgot about it yeah. um, without lyrics then I usually when when I compose something with with a melody I just do some random English words whatever sure. um, and I really wanted to have a Swiss German or a Swedish song on the album and it somehow didn't fit for any other song and then uh, when we were in our songwriting camp in the mountains I just found this demo and I showed it uh, to to everybody and we were like Okay, let's let's do it. And uh, of course, we were thinking about Kun Janssen. We we know yeah. him from Epica because Epica, we were playing yeah. with Elv80 together. Course, so he's course. so nice, so talented, and uh, something was still missing in this track. And yeah. he really brought yeah. this special magic to it. Yeah, I was going to say his emotions that he plays with. Um, I think it really kind of pulled the track together nicely. So that was great. I wanted to ask also, how's the reception been for the new music Oh, here in the States? I, we had our one show so far and yeah. I think it went really well, right? Mm -hmm. People seem to like it. They were smiling, they were moving, right? Mm -hmm. I think people are also super open here, open-minded and um, yeah, we love that. Yeah. Cool. All right, awesome. Um, and then the final question I had for you guys, um, I wanted to ask, so out here in the US, I know it's your first time in New York, what's something that you're looking forward to? outside of playing the show tonight? I'm really looking forward to playing in Los Angeles because some friends of okay. mine are coming out to listen. So, and other than that, just being in all the different cities and states I've never been to. So, nice. um, yeah, just meeting the people. Americans are super like hearty and excited and warm. So, yeah, yeah. so I really love that. Mm -hmm. So, and how about for you, Fabi? What are you looking forward to? Oh. I mean, besides the shows, um, yeah, yeah, you know, just just sucking in the atmosphere of this country. Uh, okay, it is so special. We were talking about it when we arrived. It's like, man, it just has something, yeah. and I think it's very special to tour here for us. For coming from Switzerland, from such a small country, it's really unbelievable how you can tour in the same country for a whole month and sure. so many different atmospheres in the different places i yeah, love it that's yeah. great that's great yeah. so thank you both so much for taking the time to chat tonight um again we're going to be in new york city gramercy theater tonight uh it's going to be a luma shade it's going to be visions of the lance it's going to be corpi clani thank you both so much again for your time i really appreciate it thank you so much thank for having you. us thank you, thank you. take care